Hey guys, I'm John with Tops and Brews, and today I'm going to show you the difference between this and this. Now, what do I mean by this and this? These are just two glasses, right? Well, not really. One glass is actually just dishwasher clean, where the other glass is what we call beer clean. What is beer clean? Well, if you've ever poured yourself a beer into a glass, you ever notice those tiny little bubbles on the side? Yeah, those ones. Well, that's actually dirt, grease, grime, whatever. It's something sticking to the glass that shouldn't be there. Is it unhealthy? Yeah, it's fine, technically. But does it look really nice? No. And honestly, it's not the best for your beer which we want the best for our beer. So what is this doing to your beer? Well, the CO2 attaches itself to the dirt, the grime, the leftover soap, grease, whatever's still in this glass. And it's causing the CO2 to dissipate a lot faster, causing your beer to go flatter, faster. And does it taste all that big of a difference? Let's find out. Let's nice taste some beer. You know, this is actually a lot crisper. Already, this beer has a little bit of a flat taste to it. How do you get this beer clean glass? So, how do you get your beer clean glass? Well, when you're done with your beer, as I am now, give it a good rinse, like you would any normal glassware. If you found that you left your beer glass out overnight, just let it soak for a little bit and you should be fine. Now, on your other side, you'll want to fill it with some warm water. Now, what you'll need is some food grade sanitizer. If you don't have this, a little bit of the powdered OxyClean will work just fine. Just make sure it's fully dissolved. Dump a quarter of an ounce. Let's get a little suds in there. And just rinse your glass. the inside, swirl, scrub it a little bit. Make sure to always have a clean sponge and rinse it out again. Just give it a good, good couple good wash throughs and always rinse with warm water. Now, never let your glass just sit there standing up and dry. Turn it upside down if you can with a rag underneath of it or preferably on a drying rack. If you don't have a drying rack, try to at least tilt it to where there's some air going through it. Once dry, you'll have a perfectly clean looking glass. All right, so let's check out if this glass is now beer clean. And there you have it, two beer clean glasses. Well, I'm John. See you guys later. Mm. Oh, chicken's done. Stupid cake blowing. <laughs>